I'm here at the Lake Club in Poland for Annika for East Palestine. It's a big day at the Lake Club as local and national celebrities are joining Annika Sorenstam for a fundraiser, a day of golf and raising money for the people of East Palestine. The celebrity charity golf outing in partnership with the Youngstown Mahoning Valley United Way and the Way Station was hosted by Ed Moransky of the Moransky Companies and Annika Sorenstam. Sorenstam is often regarded as the greatest female golfer of all time. She's married to Mike McGee, who is the son of legendary PGA Tour champion Jerry McGee. Mike is also a native of East Palestine. Celebrities from all walks showed up early this morning, not just to play golf, but to help those in East Palestine who desperately need help after the February 3rd train derailment, many with local ties. Jason Kokrak is an LIV Golf Tour pro and a Warren JFK grad. As I grew up in Warren, as you know, a member of this community, I still live in Ohio. Um, it, it means a lot to support Annika and, and this cause to bring a little bit of life back to this community. And, uh, it's been, uh, you know, a, a global thing. It's been a, a bigger thing than most people think. So it's a, it's a pleasure to be here and take part and uh, to uplift and support the community. I mean, we're trying to help in every capacity. I mean, them people are going to need help for a long time. So this can't be, this can't be a one and done. This has to be one of many future events to keep showing the love to that, that community. The event also featured retired NFL quarterback and boardman native Bernie Kosar, former YSU president Jim Tressel, former Cavalier Austin Carr, former Steelers player John Banasak, and Youngstown native Bob Stoops, who just coached the XFL's Arlington Renegades to championship. Well, I'm really happy to be back to help uh, fundraise here for the people of East Palestine and uh, friends with Big Ed Moransky, my buddy, and then, uh, you know, to be here with Mike McGee and Annika uh, Sorenstam, so excited about it and uh, really, uh, you know, we just want to give back. Now, all of the proceeds raised today are going to go directly to the community of East Palestine for whatever their needs may be after the February 3rd train derailment. You can also still donate at Annika for EastPalestine.com slash donate. In Poland, Brandy Johanches, WKBN 27 First News. Hi everyone, I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.